So, the truck is getting ready. It's gonna take, it takes half an hour to get it ready. And he's asking to move the van. I moved it. All the garbage. This place is very clean. My beautiful wife is sitting there watching the show. Adevira! Uh, How are you, my beautiful? And now, yeah, this place is much better than what it used to look like. No garbages, all that scrap, I will use it. That is piled up properly. Uh, this is a leftover from ICF. Majority of it I will use in between the openings. Remember I talk about this a lot uh, in my other videos. I'll build my my windows bigger right and then if I need to make it smaller I use a lumber to make it smaller and then in between I'll fit these scraps in there so I don't throw it out um, so I will have enough time to order like shop around for windows properly uh, you can see all my windows except the kitchen window they all line up it all looks nice from outside and Elijah brought two guys, Joshua and Seth, and the last time um, Chris is helping me. So I got four guys for concrete. It's an important day. Uh, we have every place foamed, everything strapped, shouldn't be any issues. Uh, but we'll see, you know, you plan for everything and then uh, you'll see. Today I'll show you when he's pumping. Uh, how does a pump truck goes up? I'll show you that. Okay, here we go. As Chris is talking to Paul, concrete pump guy, and this is so truck comes up here. And fills the concrete into this. Uh, this thing has a name, I forgot what the name is. So it fills it into there and then and then the pump pumps it out of there at the bottom into the holes and where it goes. And this is what it looks like. This thing has been this is the fifth time this truck has been here. First time was for the footing and then retaining wall, and then the slab, and then wall, and then a second wall. Yeah. Munira is waiting patiently, patiently. She said, this angle looks better. Yes, so, that's what it looks like. Did you send the truck, the concrete truck? Is the concrete coming? Oh, I don't know. Oh. Just chatting about that. Just... It looks nice, yeah? How do you like the... Hi, I'm Chris. Yeah, it's Chris, yeah. That's my wife. <laughs> That's my wife, Nira. Yeah. yeah, I'm sure you know. Boss is yeah, the boss is here today. Here, here today. Okay, I think it's good enough. We'll wait for the uh, I'll take the next video when the truck comes. Okay, the concrete is here. Paul is waiting for it. Mira is asking questions. Again, every time when this thing comes up here, it's such a steep hill, I get very, very nervous. Right? So as the concrete's coming, he's pulling the pump up. And uh, oh, this is 17% grade. 
the steepest. The steepest it can be is 20%. Above 20%, uh, you gonna be past the past uh, port. So 17% is what the grade is. I have to fix that driveway. I know that, but it took a lot to, to get this. I had everything planned this week, a lot of planning. As I planned things, things came together. When you plan, it takes a lot of time to plan and uh, you save a lot of time. If you don't plan good, all this, today the event, all this is happening right now, I planned it like two weeks ago. And uh, so now I'm a lot relaxed. I'm not uh, stressed like last time. Last time I was very, very stressed. I was thinking, worrying too much and too many things to do and now I don't have to worry about that. So, but, okay, so, uh, I calculated 20 meters is what's gonna go in there. 20 meters of concrete, that is, this one takes, 10 meter maximum right now it's eight meters in there and uh, another truck with eight meters gonna come and then the following truck is seven meters so three trucks uh, full of these it's gonna go into that wall okay wish me luck so okay it looks like we are on the last wall Elijah Nash and uh, set the last one, last wall. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna. So things are. Uh, I had a couple of uh, overflows, and those are normal. or supposed to happen. Uh, so if you don't, uh, on this angle here, if you don't shove a concrete onto that corner there concrete will overflow out so that's what happened here so we shoved it in and it held it so other than that uh, this couple of bucket full that's all came out look how Paul is laughing at me hey Paul man <laughs> so we want to go up the I don't want more than three people up there anyways. So, uh, once once uh, he's done with the vibrator, I'll pass you the video. Okay. And then you, uh, yeah. maybe it's the last, when we get uh, when we get to there, I'll pass it to you. Okay. Where do I see that video? Huh? Where do I see it? YouTube. YouTube? Rocky Rookie, Rocky Rookie channel. Send me a text. Ro Rocky. Rocky Rookie House. Yeah, send me a text. I'm gonna send edit a little bit. What? Send me a text. Yeah, yeah, I will. I'll, I'll look at it. Yeah, yeah. Look at the concrete flowing. Holy oh, cow. So. Where they are right now is uh, the highest point. So only this wall is left. Uh, I'm trying to take a, a video of it once I get to that end. This is the last one, right, Paul? So we started one o'clock. It's almost three now. My wife will tell you that's what she's here for. Oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> she said like I wanted this place. <laughs> so yeah, I put a laser laser there 
and when I run laser line, I cut the top of the ICF, so it should be level all around. And then uh, Chris put another laser line there because the, the wall will settle, like this wall will settle down uh, everywhere from corner to corner, it's different. So we need to put a laser line in order to make sure uh, all the concrete is level. Even after a pour, the, the wall will, the pressure of the concrete will settle it. So we got to make sure, even after you make sure it's cut and everything, you still have to make sure that it's level because it's not going to be the same as your level after the concrete pour because the concrete will, uh, will push it, push the wall down. All right? Okay. Uh, so, so far, so good. Very happy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, as soon as he passes this window, I'll pass it to you. Huh? Oh, yeah? Okay. Just get a couple of close up shots yeah. and then pass it back to me. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, man. You're the man. Paul, oh, good job, man. You're the man. I love you. Thank you. Another po uh, Portuguese uh, construction guy. It's all concrete stuff, yeah. Watch it, yeah. That's uh, made in Ethiopia. The ladder is made in Ethiopia, yeah. Paul, did you hear what I said? The ladder is made in Ethiopia. <laughs> Too high, yeah. <laughs> All right, done. So next one is just falling the top. <laughs> 